Welcome to this tutorial on how to use the Wix Editor menus. The Wix Editor is full of features to help you create a professional and functional site. There are three main menus we will look at. The left menu, the top bar menu, and the right click menu. First, choose a website in your dashboard and select Edit Site to enter your website editor. Let's start with the left menu. On top of the bar is the Add Elements button. Here, you'll find different elements. Choose an element that fits your page by dragging and dropping it to your desired position. Next, the Add Section button offers various section templates. You can choose a blank section or select one from the list. Then the Site Pages and Menu button provides options for the Site Menu, Site Map, Login Members Area, and Pop-ups. Moving on, the Site Design button includes five options. The Site Theme option allows you to change the overall theme of your page. The Color Theme option lets you adjust colors across your site. The Text Theme option allows you to change the font of your site. The Page Background option lets you edit the existing background or change it entirely. Lastly, the Page Transitions option allows you to customize how pages transition. The Wix App Market lets you discover apps in different categories. You can even search for specific apps like Multilingual. Next, the My Business button offers options like Wix Forms and Payments, Wix Member Area, and Find Apps. Moving on to the Media button, you can upload media from your computer and explore other media options. Navigate to CMS to create datasets and collections. Use Marketing and SEO to set marketing and SEO settings for your website. In the bottom left corner, you'll find AI tools to create text and generate sections using AI tools. Lastly, the Layer button helps you find the layers of elements, sections, and the footer. Next, we will explore the top bar menu. At the top left side, the Page section shows all the pages you have created. By selecting a page, you can edit it right away. The desktop icon allows you to edit the desktop version of your website. Next to it, the mobile icon lets you edit the mobile view of your site. You can switch between these two views. On the right-hand side of the bar, you'll find the undo and redo icons to undo or redo your last actions, the zoom out icon, and the tools icon, where you can show or hide the editor toolbar, rulers, grid lines, and snap to object features. The search bar allows you to find apps, elements, or help topics. On top of this is the main navigation bar. Clicking the Wix logo leads you to your site's dashboard. The Site option allows you to access site settings. The Settings option lets you adjust various site settings. The Dev Mode option enables Developer Mode. The Hire a Professional option helps you find professional assistance. The Help option provides access to help resources. Lastly, you'll find elements like Upgrade, Save, Preview, and the Publish button. There is one more menu, the Right Click menu. Right click any element to open the Right Click menu. Here you'll find options and actions that vary depending on the element you select. If you want more space to work within your editor, you can hide the controls, menus, and tools by clicking the controls arrow at the top of the editor. Click the arrow again to return to the normal editor view. That's it. Now you know how to use the Wix editor menus. It's that simple. If you have any feedback or questions, please let us know in the comments below. And if you don't have a Wix account yet, no problem. You can sign up for a 100% free account using the link in the description below and start building your own website today.